Hey there friends, it's Nick and this is episode uh, 448, sorry, of the Story Hacker podcast. And weird things are happening actually, because I've been at this for a while, I've noticed, I'm noticing the odd pattern appearing. And if you were listening a year ago, episode 87, I think, The Danger of Cupcakes, you may remember that I was talking about how my daughter and I had been making our Christmas cake over the weekend and she'd also made some cupcakes and I had this metaphor which I beat to death about um, about how cupcakes are available almost straight away when you bake them. They are light and fluffy but fairly insubstantial whereas the Christmas cake takes time, it needs to mature, it needs to be fed brandy but the result is deeper and more complex and actually more satisfying, at least to me. It will depend on your cake preferences. And um, here we are again, it's December again, and over the weekend, Abby and I made our Christmas cake for 2020, which is a lovely, a lovely little tradition, actually, that we've developed. And uh, a couple of things came out of it, no, nothing particularly um, earth shattering, but if you heard episode 437, you'll have heard me talk about systems and the, the importance of thinking about and treating our businesses as systems where the value is emergent and it's not dependent on optimising individual kind of elements. And one of the things that I thought about while we were baking this cake is how that's such a, just a, such a fantastic metaphor for emergent value. Because if you lined up all the ingredients for your cake and then ate them, you obviously wouldn't, <laughs> don't, don't try this at home, you obviously wouldn't, exp you wouldn't get the experience of actually eating the cake that once it's made, the value, the taste, the texture, the, all that lovely depth in a Christmas cake is emergent from the system, it is more than the sum of its parts. So I, I picked up that and I thought I'd share that. There you go, that's an annual cake metaphor for you. There's our new tradition together. But also the other thing is just the loveliness, actually, of collaborating on something creative with, with, with someone. And I think, you know, I mean, since I, I stopped working at the agency, since I sold the agency, it's one of the things I've missed most, I think, is back collaborating with creative, funny people on stuff. And... Um, whether it's, it's with your colleagues or with your kids, it's something I, I heartily recommend. And Abby and I had a lot of stupid fun over the weekend making this cake. And now I'm looking forward to starting to feed it with brandy. Thanks for listening. And remember, your story means business. <laughs>